Blake, Jack, Nathan Savage getting ready for the main event. Let me tell you, it's going to be great. Blake Richards and Forsaken, I tell you, I don't know what to think about this one. You know, I can't wait, Dirty Bird. It's going to be one heck of a matchup between Forsaken and Blake Richards. Man, I, I just can't wait to see it. Hellcat's going to be beside the ring, too. I just, oh, man. I know you like that Hellcat, don't you? I tell you, it's one of the greatest things ever. And Hold up just a minute. Why don't you let somebody who actually matters talk for once, okay? All I've got to say is that this man right here, Blake Richards, you better watch your back, son, because he is coming for you and he is going to tear you apart. And as for your little valet, Tristan, she needs to watch her back, too, because she'll be at ringside and so will I, and I don't take anything off of anybody. Harsh words right there from Hellcat. We're going to go ahead and give it over to Big Dog Mike Johnson in the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the ring this time. Being accompanied by Hellcat from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 195 pounds, by the beautiful Tristan. Blake Richards, what's your plans here in the AWF? Well, as you know, I am the very first AWF champion, and I'm gonna get my belt back. But the fact of the matter is, is that we've got a new show, and it's gonna be spotlighted by the man, the myth, and the legend, Blake Richards. And you're gonna find out what the gun show is all about, because I'm gonna be coming in, making people famous. And you know what, Jimmy? That's the way it is. And the harsh words right there from the man, the myth, the legend, Blake Richards. And you can't forget about the beautiful Tristan that's right beside him every step of the way. I tell you, these fans really like this Blake Richards. They're get, beginning to like him. He, he doesn't have fans, but they like him for some reason. For some odd reason, I don't know why. Maybe they just like Tristan, I guess. You know, who would not like Tristan? Those lime green pants and the man, the myth, the legend shirts he usually wears. Because they're not an awesome top. I'm Jay Man showing more than she's ever shown. I don't know where you show this on TV, in fact. This is the main event right here. You can't forget about July 12th, Hartford, Alabama, the Johnny Hughes Community Center. It's just going to be great. That is very true. I can't wait to see what's going to happen during this match right here. Blake Richards and Forsaken, both on the outside. Usually, Hellcat really gets really involved in these matches, and uh, I'm expecting none, nothing less from her tonight in this great, great matchup between Blake Richards and Forsaken. Of course, you know Tristan and Hellcat don't get along very, uh, very well. No, I, I noticed that. They don't like each other. I seen them in the back, and when they walk by each other, they just had that little evil eye on each other. I mean, that's just crazy. You ought to be in the back just to see that. Well, of course, you know the reason why that is, is Tristan was so upset that Hellcat won that Divas matchup, and she is the first AWF Diva. She is the AWF Diva. That bikini's matchup, she is so sexy, man. I'm telling you. Yeah, it's just great. Look at the elevation on that suplex. Did you see that, Blackjack? It was a spectacular, but never know Blake Richards climbing. We could be seeing the elbow right here. No, yes, the elbow, but he misses. Forsaken, barely moving out of the way right there. And Blake Richards popping straight back up to his feet. Atomic drop straight down. Only Gunanis, I don't know what to call it. Ben one, two, two count only. And run an atomic drop, taking Blake Richards out of the match and so far. A uh, nice commentary there, Jimmy. The color commentary was awesome. Uh, there we go for a second half in one, two, two count only. Unable to keep him down for the three, but close enough, you know, but close call, but it was cigar, Jimmy. That's what they say, I guess. Oh, yes, and now for a second back with a Russian leg sweep, which is one of his great specialties here in the AWF because he's going for the second one and down. Look at that. Look at the power right there. It's just awesome. 
not only the power, but the tenacity and the way that he keeps going and going and going. He's like an energizer, but he never stops. He keeps beating on that drum, beating on that drum. And, and speaking of beating on the drum, Forsaken beats on his own drum. You know, he, he doesn't follow anyone else. And he, he and Hellcat are just made for each other. They go and go and go. And there's no stopping him. I think, you know, if they could go all the way to AWL. But you got to think of the, the, the attire. Look at the attire Blake Richard brings out to the ring. Great costumes by both of these men and great athleticism by both of these men. They're faster. They're the fastest men in the AWF, I believe, Black Jack. <laughs> That they are. And Blake Richards, of course, during his interview said he is the first ever American Wrestling Federation heavyweight champion. And that is true. But he's also the first ever loser of the American Wrestling Federation championship. And uh, I don't think you've been too pleased about have said that. But hey, you know, the truth hurts sometimes. Pin one, two. Kick out. That was great right there, Black Jack, I tell you. And now Blake Richards back in control of this match here against Forsaken. Oh, and a low blow. Did you see him just low blow Blake Richards again, twice? Ricky Blake, don't know what to do about that. It would be hard for me if I were Ricky Black to disqualify either one of these men because they have gone so far in the American Wrestling Federation today. You know, I just don't know. Both men bring so much to the table. Their cards are oh, Forsaken! was a great athleticism there. Oh, kick to the midsection, off the roads, and the legend, it's the legend. Now with the, his finisher, one, two, three. 